Hey, what's good, family? It's been a minute since we've checked in on the portfolio. I started back in April where I'm dollar cost averaging into a couple stocks every day. So in this video, we're going to take a look at the portfolio, see how it's doing. And in the end of this video, we're going to take a look at the technicals. One of these stocks is taking off right now. All right. So here we are in the interactive brokers mobile platform. Uh, taking a look at my portfolio, you can see uh, right now the overall value is $2,815. Uh, we're up $30 on a day. Uh, overall, on everything invested, we're up $227. All the money I have invested is worth just under $2,700. And taking a look at my positions, you can see I have PayPal, SMCI, and Tesla. I, I want to make a note that I have been dollar cost averaging into PayPal and dollar cost averaging into Tesla, $10 each day into PayPal, $12 each day that the market's open into Tesla. And the SMI, I did a one-time purchase of $301. And we are down pretty bad on that. All right, so taking a look overall uh, on the day, my overall PayPal position, we're up $40.40. .40. Uh, this is the beauty of just dollar cost averaging, putting $10 in a day been doing this since April. It is August now, so not too bad. We're up $40 on the day. SMCI, we are down. This is why you don't try to time the market. The stock is down probably like $200 since I purchased it, so not doing too hot on that. May throw a little more in it, but it's not something that I dollar cost average into. Uh, taking a look at Tesla, Tesla is, is down on the day, but overall from where we bought it at, doing pretty good. So overall, my cost basis, my, my average cost on PayPal, I have put $163 overall into it. Tesla, $1,102 into it. Average price on PayPal, $63.58. I was down, but now I'm up on this. PayPal is a stock, of course, that I mentioned earlier, has recently taken off. I think over the past week I went from negative to up 13% on this and I think this is only the beginning of the move. This, this is why I started investing in PayPal. It was severely undervalued. I still think it's severely undervalued. Uh, it has a lot of growth ahead of it from where it is right now. And yeah, we're going to take a look at the technicals, but getting back to it, I hold 16.7161 shares of PayPal, uh, Tesla 5.708, and SMCI 0.37. If it weren't for SMCI overall, I would be up over $300 on the just over $2,100 I have invested. But overall, not too bad, even, even with SMCI being in a red, still doing all right overall. Now here's a look at the charts for what I see with PayPal. All right. So looking at PayPal on a monthly chart, PayPal up until PayPal pulled back to these levels, PayPal has not really been to these levels since 2018. And then as low as it was, it hasn't been there since July of 2017. So understand that right now, PayPal is a major opportunity. I want to take a moment to say I'm not a financial advisor. This isn't financial advice, but I do want to put it on your radar. This is something that PayPal is something I've seen as severely undervalued. And at its all-time highs, PayPal got just over $300. Um, is pay, do I think PayPal is worth $300 right now? No. If I were to put a price target on PayPal right now, I'd be around 180 and, and I'm not going to lie. I'm kind of pulling that out of my butt, but I'm expecting at least a double up from this. My average cost is around $60 and that's what I'm eyeing from PayPal. Uh, getting more technical, looking at PayPal on the weekly, uh, on the weekly chart, PayPal was in a downtrend. I know it's kind of hard to see on my phone. PayPal was in a downtrend uh, from pretty much like it was respecting this trend line from March 2022 all the way up until about November of 2023 when it broke above this. And we've really just been consolidating between 
55 and about 69 70 dollars since then but today or this week this week has kind of changed it all we have broken out above this 68 69 dollar level and it's looking like the beginning of a new trend the next major level i would look for paypal to take out is this 65 or this this 75 76 area and then if we can take that the next major level is about 85 dollars so to those of you wondering hey what's the purpose of this video why are you showing me this it is truly my intention to add some kind of value to your life every time i make a video and the purpose of me making this video is to show you i have been dollar cost averaging into paypal in this account that i started on this channel since april this year of 2024 i knew a move was coming for paypal i still know a move is coming for paypal but i did not know when it would start i don't know when it will end so because of that me seeing its potential me seeing how undervalued it is i took advantage i I, I didn't feel the need to throw all my money in. I didn't feel the need to try to buy the bottom. I took a very doable amount that has not really affected me financially, $10 a day. And to this day, from when I started, I put in more than $1,000 in the position. And just through dollar cost averaging, I'm growing my account, I'm beating the bank, and I still have plenty of growth ahead in this stock. If you're interested in getting 20 free stocks and you haven't already taken advantage of it, be sure to sign up for Moomoo using the referral link down below in the description. If, if you're interested in checking out Interactive Brokers, the platform I use in this video, uh, check out the link down below in the description. It's not a referral link, but it does help the channel out if you click on it. If you learned anything or found this video to be helpful, be sure to smash the like button. And if for some reason you made it this far and haven't already, what are you doing? Be sure to subscribe, hit the bell notification icon so that you don't miss any future content. And last, but certainly not least, thank you so much for watching. Matthew Manuel signing off, and I want to change your life.